Dope Boy TV gang stand up. It's your boy Dope Boy TV, man. I need y'all to go subscribe to this channel. I want y'all to follow me on all my social medias, Facebook and Twitter, man. We stepping out here, man. You already know we got hot topics, man. What's the topics on the floor? Let's find out. Okay, man. I got to talk about Sauce Walker, man, because this man is the real definition of a big homie or an OG or just a role model for the younger generation, especially the black community, because like it's so much competition within the black community when if it comes to materialistic things to, you know, just, you know, brain power, like people compete with anything. And it's just so sad because it's like people don't understand the value of teamwork and what teamwork can get you in getting creating a team or having people to back you up. And so I was walking just one of the people who really I look at and be like, dang, you know what? If it was more people like him, the 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 poverty communities will be better because at the end of the day, it's so many people that's in poverty and don't got nothing. So they fighting over the little stuff that they do have. And there's not enough people or it's not enough old heads for people that's older to tell the younger generation right from wrong. They just steady crashing them. And it's like Sauce Walker teaching people and motivating people. Like at the end of the day, he's showing, of course, he's showing all these diamonds, money and things of that nature. But it's either going to do two things, going to motivate you or make you hate more. And that's the problem. We got too many haters. They don't want to see other people succeed. Like people feel to understand when Sauce Walker putting this, he's spending 80,000, hundreds of thousands of dollars on his people. You get what I'm saying? He spent a hundred thousand dollars on his his artists and it and it's showing love and it's great. It's gonna show them love and it's gonna show them that you know what? When I get money, I can do this for somebody else. I can help somebody else out instead of trying to crash him. Instead of trying to give him a bag for, to go, you know, hit up somebody or go stump somebody out or things of that nature. Let me let me show you how to be a businessman and create your own brand or something to make money off of. And then while you making money, I'm going to still put money in your pocket like a real CEO and not crash you. I'm going to have you doing stuff the right way, you know? And I feel like Sauce Walker is one of the last real OGs left. And he really, you know, putting on for Texas. I just feel like if it was more people like Sauce Walker to show young people that to like, you know, help each other out, build a team, and make your whole team successful. Because at the end of the day, it's not just cool for one one person out the group to be shining. You ain't you get what I'm saying? Because you paying for everything, you doing everything, you, gonna, you get what I'm saying? But if everybody got money, we all good. But let me know how y'all feel about this. I might think that I'm wrong, but I really think Sauce Walker is a model OG, model big homie, model whatever you want to call him, model role model for, for the youth. Because at the end of the day, he not... In every song like Kill Kill, this and that. He ain't in every song calling all, you get what I'm saying? But let me know how y'all feel about this situation or if it's somebody who a better role model and somebody who putting on for they, they you feel me, they click or they gang or they just they people, they family better than Sauce Walker is. Because he putting on for his family, friends, and associates. Like at the end of the day, he's signing people, changing their lives for real, for real. But I'm going to let y'all hear and see the video that made me really really think about this because he said some real spill in this video i'm gonna let y'all watch it let me know how y'all feel about it down in the comments your boy double boy tv if you're rocking with me subscribe if not kick rocks let me tell you one thing let me let me think on this right here for one second man the reason why i'm gonna make a separate post about this too man so we're gonna keep this short when, while we motherfucking me show the world, while we motherfucking bless our brothers and show love to our brothers and, man, and motherfucking me buy each other shit, man, and, and want to see each other grow and shine and, and be better, because that's what the motherfucking world need to see. Motherfucker need to stop hating and being stop competition hating, with these motherfucking children. I'm, I'm, I'm saying, brothers, I'm hearing And not want to see the next man have the same thing, say, man. Oh, I you just knocked down them all 50,000 with my boys. I just took my boy and bought them a fleet of cars. I'm here. Yeah, man, you know what I'm saying? Because why? Cause Sauce Walker sending out that energy, man. Sauce Walker making niggas get inspired to be a big boss of Ohio. You know what I'm saying? I'm making these niggas realize that I need to stop being selfish and start sharing the wealthish. You know what I'm talking about? I'm making these niggas stop motherfucking want to be the only nigga with the diamonds and trying to have everybody blinded. You know what I'm talking uh -huh. about? Yeah, like that. I'm a nigga that's gonna make your CEO keep grinding. Ain't nothing wrong with that because that's what I want to happen, man. We need to show we need to show positivity and growth amongst black brothers. And not only the positivity 